Speaking of green, look I at know, how beautiful I was just going to say, wow. lots of green here in Dayton <laughs> on the Stoller Family Estate camera. Uh, it's fairly cloudy, but the cloud's not too dark right now. 61 degrees. We're in about the mid-60s here in the metro area. And here's quite a view. Green as well uh, on the mountain. This is uh, from the base area of our Adventure Park at Ski Bowl camera. You can see the lift there. Obviously, not much snow left on the ground. Uh, taking a look at our weather for today, the coast is turning mostly sunny and dry. It is mostly sunny out there now. Uh, really nice skies. Temperatures will be into about the low 60s. Very similar temperatures to what we've had over the last few days. We're cooler here in the valleys about upper 60s to right around 70 degrees. Might see some isolated showers as we go into the afternoon. The Columbia Gorge uh, might see a few showers on the west end as well. Temperatures will be into the upper 60s to lower 70s, mid 70s in the Dalles. Winds a bit breezy at 20 to 25 miles per hour. Then partly cloudy on Mount Hood might see a shower or two also. 53 degrees for the high at Government Camp and Ski Bowl into the low 60s down towards Welch's. And then partly cloudy with showers into the northeastern mountains of eastern Oregon, similar to what we saw yesterday. Temperatures into uh, the 60s for the most part. Pendleton might be right around 70 degrees. So taking a look at the rain for the next five days, you can see not much. We might see some really late night showers tomorrow or kind of overnight showers into Wednesday. And then Thursday, we'll start to see some evening showers, but you can see not much there. And then showers for your Friday, some more showers for your Saturday as well. Saturday, it looks like that precipitation could be picking up a little bit. Here's a look at some possible amounts as we head towards the end of the week. It looks like Friday could be turning a little bit wetter, somewhere around uh, maybe half an inch to three quarters of an inch of precipitation. And then we could be adding even more as we go into the weekend and into next week beyond. You can see uh, possible that we could uh, see more than we would typically see in the month of June here in about the next seven days or so. And as we take a look at the Climate Prediction Center for temperatures over uh, the next couple of weeks, maybe right around average for the next week or so. But then as we get towards the middle to end of June, it looks like those temperatures could be staying on the cooler end. Of course, that is a prediction. We'll see what actually happens as we head through the next few weeks here. But tomorrow is going to be a nice warm day. I think we'll get into the low 80s uh, and they'll be into about the mid 70s for a couple days here. But we will be a bit cooler as we head towards the weekend Friday, especially upper 60s and then low 70s for your Saturday and Sunday, which is again right around average. So for the junior parade, things are looking dry right now. But as for as for the grand floral parade, looks like we could be seeing some wet weather for another parade. Kim.